Hello and welcome back to Simply Mobile. So this week we're doing my top seven favorite iPhone hacks. Last week we did hacks for the reminders, so if you missed that one, I'll pop it at the end. But there's a real buzz around the iPhone 12 at the moment, so I actually found a great deal on that. So I'll put it in the description if you're trying to get a hold of one. This is just seven hacks in general. So some you'll know, some you might not, but they all take seconds, so they're worth knowing. And um, so here's seven, enjoy. Okay, so the first trick I'm going to show you is how to turn off notifications when an app asks you to rate or review it. We all know them, you download an app and it constantly pesters you asking to rate it. So if you go into settings, scroll down to app store and select, and at the very bottom you will see in-app ratings and reviews. Simply just tick this off and you'll no longer be pestered. So number two, if you ever find yourself in trouble or you need to call the emergency services and you don't have time to type, simply go to settings, scroll down to emergency SOS and select call with side button. Now, if your phone is locked or in your pocket, simply hold and press the power bar five times and it will automatically start calling. The number three is for the calculator. Now, if you want to clear, obviously when you press this, it gets rid of the entire number. But if you want to just get rid of one digit, simply swipe from one side of the screen to the other. So another thing that a lot of people don't know is your phone actually has a built-in tape measure. So if you just select the corner of something and then drag it up from one point to the other. Now this is pretty accurate. You don't overly need a steady hand, but it does help. Now I'm doing this very fast. You will obviously do this a lot better than I. But just to give you an idea, it is very handy if you don't have a tape measure lying around. So as you can see, some pretty accurate results. For number five, it's how to turn your space bar into a cursor or a trackpad. So if you've made a mistake while you're texting someone, rather than having to try and select into the text and you're selecting the wrong thing, if you just press and hold the space bar, it turns it into a trackpad or a cursor and you're able to select the character a lot easier. Number six is another quick texting hack. So if you press one, two, three, it will give you numbers and alternative characters. And you can select this just like so. However, you have to then press ABC to go back to the normal keypad. If you just press and drag on one, two, three, it will then pop back to the original pad. For the seventh and final hack is how to sign documents quickly from your email. So if you select into the document within your email, there'll be an icon in the top right hand corner. Select this and then select the plus sign in the bottom right hand corner. It'll then give you a list of text signature or magnifier. If you just select signature and then use your screen as your trackpad, press done when you're happy and then you can place the signature wherever you like to forward on. So that is the seven, but we release videos all the time. So make sure to subscribe. If there's something that you'd like to know, pop it in the comments and we can do a video on that too. But next up is how to get the best out of your reminders.